We are just days away from the debut of the new SB Ballard Stadium at Old Dominion University. Saturday, this is going to look a lot different. Monarchs are going to be taking on local rival Norfolk State. If you can't wait that long to get an inside look, well, 10 on your side's Jason Marks is there right now getting a behind the scenes look before it opens to fans. How's it looking, Jason? I needed this place is amazing and to think that they did this in nine months. I mean, take a look at this is what they're finishing up. They still have the press boxes. Those are brand new. They can see crews are still working on some of the suites, the brand new seating here. Uh, it really is amazing. And all in nine months, uh, joining me now is a man who is really behind some of the architecture here. Uh, this is Jeff Heider with Mosley Architects and talk about some of the features. We've, we've, we've tasted the food, we've sat in the seat, so those are the good things. But talking about the cool things that we don't know that, that people aren't going to see. Well, it's incredible. Be a part of such amazing facility. Uh, you're not going to find premium spaces anywhere in the country that are closer to the field. The game day atmosphere is going to be second to none. Every seat has a premium sight line. Just beautiful. It should be incredibly loud. Students are being relocated to the sidelines now from the end zone, so they're going to be right on top of the field. It's going to be very intimidating for opposing field, uh, teams that come into play. Uh, it's just going to be really exciting on Saturday and night. And you guys really, uh, when you when we when we think about something like this, we think about the major details. But you went down to the small things, like uh, talking about sea level rise. And I mean, it's crazy. Yeah, when you do a facility like this, first and foremost, you've got to make it be about the, the the location. So this facility is really ODU. Every piece of it's ODU. And of course, we're very sensitive to what's going on around here with ODU. So we've got to make sure that that we meet all the sea level regulations, and we make sure that we we have everything set up so that we don't have flooding issues. Um, um, every other thing too, the, the Williamsburg Lawn, the way the entrance is on the east side that faces Williamsburg Lawn and the historic factor, trying to bring back all of the history of the old Foreman Field and bring it into this facility, the detailing of the brick on the field, just to give you that feel that it is truly ODU and it fits great with this campus. Thank you so much. Great job. It looks amazing. No, outstanding. Thanks for having me. Yeah, Thank you. Saturday night, big game, 7 o'clock. That's when the game takes place uh, against Norfolk State. Anita, it's going to be an amazing atmosphere. They're saying they sold at least 5,500 student seats. So this place is going to be rocking. Now back to you. Oh, yeah. I'm sure a lot of people are going to be there. Be sure to catch a 10 on your side sports special. ODU's new stadium, the making of a monarch. We'll take you inside the new football stadium before it opens, and you'll hear from the man who built it and the legacy he hopes to leave. The sports special is tonight at 7 right here on Wavy TV 10.